Alright guys, today we're going to be looking at how to clip a ferret's nails. All you need is some type of clippers. You can use human clippers or like small cat clippers will work just fine as well. You want to be careful when cutting not to cut too far. There's blood vessels that go into the uh, into the nails and you don't want to cut too deep that you make them bleed. If you do happen to make them bleed, flour is great at stopping uh, bleeding from a nail. Just all purpose home flour. So what we're going to do is, he's going to be a little rambunctious, it might be hard just to hold his hand here and do everything. So sometimes a good idea, I'm going to scruff him for a second, sometimes a good idea is to take some type of treat, I got a little peanut butter here, and I'm going to actually, he's going to let him smell it, he wants it as you can see. I'm actually going to rub it right here on his tummy. This might seem messy, but he's going to lick it all off. When he finds it out that it's there, I'm going to move the container away from him. Hopefully he'll find out it's there pretty soon. Look, it's right there. He should just kind of sit there eating it while you're able to clip his nails. He might have got that off really quick. Let me get a little bit more on there. You can give him a little small bath afterwards just to uh, get the rest of it off. So now he'll probably sit there. He should sit there trying to eat it for a little while. And while he, while he does that, you should be able to clip his nails. Sean, look at what you got on your tummy. Look at this, Sean. Look, look what you got on your tummy. See that? So now while he's eating, if he stays there, I should be able to start clipping, but he's moving a little bit. There's one, two, three. Sean, look, you still got a lot on you. Some ferrets will be better too over time. This is his first nail clipping. Look what's on your tummy. And he'll just sit there eating. He's not even moving his claws, so he's making it real easy. Missed one on this other side, which you guys can't see right now. And we still got to get his back feet here. So hopefully he'll go back for it some more. Look, you still got some. Look, 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 Sean. Look. And now he'll just sit there again while I can finish his back feet. And he doesn't respond at all to the cutting as long as you don't cut too deep. He jumped a little there, but he's not bleeding. It's not too deep. Look, Sean, you still got more. Look. Let me get this last foot. They hold their feet pretty still, at least he does. So it's one handed is pretty easy. Sean. And you know, this could take a couple minutes, but as you see, I've gotten through three three out of four feet here in not too long. You just try to keep them occupied with that food. Let me see if I can get two of these at once. Sean, hold on, I got two left. One. Hold on, don't move, I don't want to cut it too far. Two. You're done, Sean. I think I might have missed this one. Hold on. No, I got it. And there we have it. Got him done. Fully uh, nail trimmed. Pretty quick and easy. I think I might have missed one on this front foot, which I'll double check after the video here. But as you can see, he'll pretty much just sit here, and you can uh, go through and check everything. Got one more over here that's a little long. And we're done. Sorry, man. So it's real simple, and then what you can just do is go to the sink, wet down a towel, and just wipe him off a little bit. I'm going to wet it down, but he'll lick most of it off. I'm going to let him just keep licking himself. And then just go wash him off, just his tummy. You don't have to give him a full bath. Just wash off his tummy where you put that stuff. Real simple trick for uh, cutting their nails. And as they get used to it, this was his first time and he did pretty good. As they get used to it, they'll usually just sit there and uh, make it real simple. As you can see, his feet weren't moving when I was trying to cut. Made it real simple. So anyways, guys, if you have questions, let me know. Otherwise, we'll see you later. Say bye, Sean.